Hey everyone, Steph here. I'm the Secret Slob and I am sick. I woke up on the weekend with this crazy cold and it's kind of lingering. So that's why my voice sounds crazy and I'm sorry, but I'm feeling pretty good today. I just, you know, felt worse on the weekend. I sound worse today. Anyways, I am on week three of getting into my zone cleaning. So if you're just joining us, I have been working through my zone cleaning. Zone cleaning is from the Fly Lady system. The Fly Lady divides her house into five zones. Um, so just a few rooms in each zone and every week works on a different zone. So we did week one, zone one, week two, zone two, and this week, week three, zone three. So zone three for my house is bathrooms, kids rooms, and laundry room. And I'll show you a quick shot of my detailed cleaning list here. I just build mine right off of hers and add rooms that she doesn't have and take rooms off that she has on there that I don't have and you know just customize it to your house. So today like I said I'm feeling sick and I didn't even get my weekly home blessing hour done yesterday. I just vacuumed and then I was like so tired I had to go back to the couch and just lay down. And so today I'm kind of picking away at it. I did my bed sheets. You know if you're not feeling well or something comes up in your life don't stress it. Don't worry about making sure that everything is perfect and you get all your check marks. This is life. You know, I got sick. I couldn't do all my chores. <laughs> Whatever. My husband picked up a lot of the slack because it was pretty much in a horizontal position all weekend. <laughs> and it's the way it goes. I didn't do laundry yesterday because I just couldn't. I'd rather not start a load of laundry and have it sitting there waiting for me when I don't have the energy to finish it. So today I have a little bit more energy and I'll probably do, well, I'll finish my sheets and that'll be my load of laundry. So that's an easy load. But, you know, if you get sick or something comes up or you go on vacation, don't worry about trying to catch up. Just keep jumping in exactly where you are. And that's what Fly Lady always says. Just, prog just keep making a little bit of progress and don't worry about perfection. Don't worry about what you missed. Just start again today, wherever it is you are. I'm still working for 15 minutes every day, Tuesday to Friday, on my zone. So I do weekly home blessing hour on Mondays, I don't do any zone cleaning, and then I do 15 minutes, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday in the zones. Wherever I get to is where I get to. So however many check marks I get on this list, that's what I get done. So I'm gonna head into my bathroom now and get started, and after 15 minutes, I'm probably gonna have to go lay on the couch again. <laughs> okay, here I go, I hope you join me. All right, so the timer is actually starting at 10 minutes today because it took me about five minutes to run around and find a bucket to put soapy water in and get my cloth together. Anyways, it's just one of those days. I've been sick, so nothing's really going well for me. But I'm gonna start by just sorting through this drawer. So it's just a really quick declutter, getting some garbage out and organizing the things that we keep in the drawer. So in this drawer, I keep all of our hair ties and hair bows. I have two little girls, and so we're constantly doing ponytails and pigtails. So I just found two containers to sort them into hair bows and hair, hair elastics, and now they're not just loose in the drawer. With little kids, I know for a fact they're just gonna get messy, but at least there's somewhere to put them. So whenever I declutter a drawer, I always give it a wipe out because it's empty and it's a perfect opportunity to give it a clean. So that drawer is done. And then the bottom drawer is just toilet paper and so I just pull everything out gave it a wipe it was really dusty actually I don't think it's ever been cleaned and then just put everything back in the outside of the cabinet was the next thing on the list to do and it definitely had some little water splashes and toothpaste marks my kids sometimes brush their teeth down here so that needed a really good wipe down it was good to get that done Next on my list is baseboards. So I'm just using a cloth with soapy water and a little bit of vinegar to go around and scrub all the baseboards. And a few people asked me what kind of supplies I use, so I just wanted to point out that today I'm using a frozen, like an Elsa washcloth from the dollar store. It's way too scratchy for anyone to use on their face, so it's one of my cleaning rags. Just going to show it doesn't take anything fancy, just a little bit of elbow grease to get your house clean. Then I'm just scrubbing down the toilet. It usually gets a good wipe down in the swish and swipe, but I don't always do the bottom part um, of the stand there. So just dusting that was good. And then I'm moving on to my floor. So same thing, I'm just using my bucket of soapy water and a little bit of vinegar, and I'm just giving my floor a good scrub. This room is pretty little, so it's kind of impossible for me to get in here with my mop. And I always think of my grandma when I clean my floor on my hands and knees, because she said you couldn't clean a floor properly unless you got down in your hands and knees and did it. And I must say, my floor is looking better than ever, so probably was worth it to get down and give it a really good scrub. 
I'm all done. Okay, so that wasn't too bad. I got every check mark for that room finished. Yeah, so my cold is basically saying it's time for a break. So I'm gonna have a little lay down and keep kind of picking at my weekly home blessing hour, finish my sheets, and I'll probably do uh, the mirrors and doors, but that's about it. I don't really have the energy to do mopping my whole floor today, so maybe I'll do that tomorrow. I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope you got started in zone three and maybe even got a whole bathroom done like I did. It's an easy one, there's no shower, so always good to start on a good note. I will talk to you tomorrow and we will carry on with zone three. Bye.